Hi, my name is Danica Raymond, and today I will be presenting to you a webinar on if Mary Shelley's book is a warning or a homage to modern scientists. In my personal beliefs, the book is mostly a warning to us today because in today's society, we can see that compared to the years past, technology has become a huge aspect for us. Before I start with my opinion, here is a resume of what the book holds in general. It is a book about Victor, our main character, who is a scientist, that wanted to create another image to the human body. This monster is something new to the world of science. Victor hopes that with this creature, people will be able to see and analyze the mistakes in humans. This creature is something that has never been done before. Therefore, the question being asked is, is Mary Shelley's novel, Frankenstein, really a warning or a homage to modern scientists? When you combine the technology of science and human knowledge, the consequences can be dangerous and disastrous. Also, the novel is seen as a warning because Victor uses a combination of both electricity and human parts to create his monster. Even though the novel was written in the 1800s, it is still used as a warning to scientists across the world. It is a very dangerous thing to play with genetics in general because that means you are changing completely the copy of the person. Also, when talking genetics, we are talking about cells, oxygen, and immune systems, none of which were taken into consideration when constructing his prototype. If we look at today's modifications in the human body, we can relate these two to various alterations such as commonly known plastic surgery. I find that the book is a warning for us because if we don't be careful to what we create, the results can be very horrific because we don't truly know what they are capable of doing. Victor created his monster using the technology of science, without even knowing what impact this creature will have on our society. If we are born into this world, how can a modified creature adapt and survive in today's society? How will, he how will others perceive him? This is another reason why the book is considered a warning, because this kind of creation could also lead to uncontrollable dangers to the society. This monster that Victor has created will eventually form his own personality and his own uniqueness. He won't want to be held by his creator his whole life which means that he will want to become more independent, his own person. This monster will form relationships with different people which can cause conflicts between himself, his creator, and also the society in general. To conclude, I found a passage from, the web, from a website cited at the end of my presentation, which states clearly why this author's question is more of a warning. The fear is that by tapering with nature and introducing genes into the organisms, we are creating monsters that might have unexpected effects on us. This concludes my presentation. Thank you.